YouTube. How's everybody doing? Hope everybody's doing well. This is Thomas with Mr. Fix All Home and Garden out of Raleigh, North Carolina, coming at you on a Monday morning in Raleigh. Oh my God. And it's nice and dreary. Chance of rain again. <clears throat> and excuse me, it never stops raining around here. But anyway, we're supposed to be getting some really good weather uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And I'm on this deck staining job. Okay, this is the upper level. It's an enclosed screen deck, and the problem I've got here is this, is that this deck needs to be power washed desperately, and I can't bring the power washer through the house, okay, so you can just see all the crap, I mean it's just nasty up here, uh, it's never been washed in a long time, um, you know it's got green on it and everything, it just looks nasty, and you can see from my vantage point, I've got my uh, power washer down there. There it is down there and uh, I'm on the second floor right now. So what I'm going to do, I've taken, these, I've taken these screens off because I can't access the place, the deck from the outside with a ladder. Plus two, what they did was they put the screws on the outside. So trying to get the screws uh, detached up there, uh, there's no way to get a ladder. Uh, trying to get these screws out from the outside because the ladder will be just hitting just be hitting the screen I'll tear the screen I don't want to do that so all I did was just take this bottom screen off and I'm gonna slip my power washer wand through here uh, and I've got 50 foot of hose so I should be good then once I get this place cleaned um, which today would be a perfect day because I need to actually power wash all three decks. So yeah, I was going to say that this is this is a multi-tiered, multi-level deck uh, house. Uh, it's got three decks on it. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, I've got a I've got a stain. I've already got the exact match for this from Sherman Williams, and stain this because uh, it's a little weathered. You can see. You know, they had they have animals. So the animals, you know, the fingernails claw the wood, and on the first floor it's the worst. But, hey guys, how's everybody doing? Look, this is, this is one of those deals I was telling you about. Okay, uh, I made mention in one of my videos about a, a gossip or a chat forum called Back Porch. Now, Back Porch is a neighborhood chat forum where, uh, you know, the local neighbors, which in this case, this is Bedford, uh, there's at least... 3,000 homes in Bedford. I think there's actually 5,000 homes in Bedford. It's a big community. And they get on these chat forums, the housewives, and they basically talk it up about contractors and other services and other just things that's going on in the neighborhood. You know, topics, things that yard sales, you know, who's your contractor, who's your plumber, who's your landscaper. So, uh, I, uh, about three weeks ago, I put a video up in regards to uh, this, this particular situation and if you're in a handyman business and you want to uh, get your name out there and these, uh, these uh, back porch columns, uh, gossip columns, are a great, a great source of uh, getting referrals. Now, I've already worked on this guy's house. I did a video of that. I did a bunch of outside wood rot repair and then of course the guy liked the way I handled everything because he said I was a breath of fresh air. He's bringing me back on this big deck staining job and this is going to take days to do. Uh, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to be here for about four days, probably more. But the whole point is, is that from that one referral, this one job, I've already gotten six to seven uh, calls. I can't get them all. Uh, I'm not going to be able to respond to everything, you know, it's depending on the size of the job, you know, if it's just replacing a sink faucet or something like that, I may have to pass on something like that because I just don't have the time. I have to go for these bigger jobs because they are the bigger money. Uh, so, but I've already got two more calls for Bedford for this week, so when I get done, say, 4 or 5 o'clock this afternoon, I'll go run over there and do a couple quick maintenance calls, make, uh, you know, a couple uh, quick maintenance calls and make 60 or 70 bucks um, on the side. So that's how this works. So once you're in, you know, like I said, if you've got a privately owned business like me, a sole proprietorship, and you start working in these neighborhoods, you know, your name will get dropped around. Only if you do quality work and if you're on time and you don't, you don't screw these people over and you do what you say you're going to do and be where you say you're going to be and all that stuff, you know, the, the normal stuff running a good business. Okay, so I just wanted to share this information with you. This starts a new week and Mr. Fixall is busy again uh, and the message is always this guys do quality work you know be honest and show up on time look like a professional you know I got all brand new clean clothes on you know you know I look like a painter so you know you got to wear the hat for the job okay you guys have a great day you know what to do subscribe hit the thumbs up share and uh, leave a comment and I'll see you guys on another video Tom out of here bye